Welcome back, everyone, to another Minecraft Survival Let's Play. It has been a minute. It's been, like, maybe two weeks, maybe a week and a half. I don't really remember, but I know it's been a minute. It's been a minute since we made a Minecraft episode. I'm trying to get some other stuff out there for you guys so you guys can have a plethora or a variety of videos to watch. We got some Dead by Daylight, some Fortnite, and we've also got some uh, stranded deep so go check those out but today we're gonna get back into minecraft and we're going to go over and work on stuff in alexandria as we always do and i think i'm going to work on the community building because we have built it and not done anything since then what are you doing in here what do you want mr fox you know what you can stay in here you can stay in here actually can i tame you are you mine, actually? Because I tamed a fox before. Are you mine? No. I tamed a fox before, and I don't know what happened to him. Apparently, taming the foxes, you have to, like, give them berries. Give two of them berries. And then the baby becomes yours. So you can't actually tame a fully grown fox for some reason. I think that's weird. But at the same time, it kind of makes sense. Foxes are weird. They are weird creatures. Um, right now, I'm going to fix up my tools because I really need to do that. My axe is not looking very good. And my sword is actually going down, surprisingly. I've used it a bunch. Um, I don't think I'm going to fix my sword because we have this amazing diamond sword that heals itself. So I don't really need a, another one, nor do I need an iron sword. But we're definitely going to need a new axe. So there's that. I'm going to mix it with this one, see what we get. Oh, only two. Okay, that's good. Perfect. And we have a bunch of food. We uh, we went out and got a ton of food off camera, so we're all good to go. I did make some cakes. Probably should have eaten a piece of cake while I was here. But we have some cakes now for when we're here and just want to eat some food. Um, but right now we're going to grab, oh, I don't know, probably a bunch of this, a bunch of this. We're just going to grab everything, I suppose. And we'll grab a stack of this, just because. Just because. Actually, I'm going to grab these, too. We're going to grab everything. Except for all the dark oak wood. Because there is too much of that, honestly. I might have to burn some of it. Okay. So we're going to head over. Actually, whoa. Before I leave, we are going to do something with this dark oak wood. Real quick. Um... Okay, so we're gonna make, where did I put them? I put them here. We're gonna make a bunch of bookshelves for our librarians. So instead of just having a lecture, they have some bookshelves. Okay, so we're actually going to use this. I wonder if I can do it myself. Boom, like that, nope, I don't want to. Okay, oh, no, oh my gosh. It's easier to do this stuff on computer. Okay, there's that. I'm gonna have to do this like a million times if I do it like this. Okay, so there's that, like so. Oh, it doesn't keep the dark oak. You know what, we're just gonna send it. We're just gonna send it. We only need like that much. We don't need too many. It doesn't matter. We'll save this dark oak wood for something else. There's another good project for us. Really, one book. Who cares? It's gonna bother me, but it's out of sight now. Okay. Um, dude, we have too much. Too much freaking dark oak wood. Look at this. This is ridiculous. I could make this castle like five times over with how much dark oak wood I have. That's not even a joke. There's so much of it in there. Anyway, we're heading back. Gonna go check out this place. It really has been a minute. I didn't realize how long it's been since I've made a survival Let's Play. But, I mean, normally I make one every week, but I, I took like a week and a half off of making Minecraft episodes. I just really wanted to have a variety out. I wanted to do something else for a little bit. It's, it's good that we're back. How's it going? I need to name you guys. Give you all some names. Okay, where are my librarians at? I know there's one in here, right? Yes. Give him two bookshelves. I think I only have three. We'll give them the remaining if I have any extra. 
He has bookshelves now, so that's good. I might have to go back and make some more so that my um, fellowship hall can have some bookshelves. Don't know why, but there we go. He's got bookshelves now. And then I think there was one in here. No, I didn't make a didn't make a guy in here. I know that's farming, farming. Might be this one. No, this one's farming, right? Yeah. Where did I put the other electric? Did I only make the two? I probably only made the two. That's okay. Yep, that's perfectly fine. We'll just uh, we'll just put the rest of these in shop. And then make a bunch more for later. And then... See, this guy's got... Boom. Yep, that looks good. That looks good. And we'll just put the other one in here like that. So he's got tall bookshelf. We'll come back and put more in there. Look at the beautiful squid church. You know, I didn't... I really did not like this at first. But it's growing on me. I really had no idea how I was going to build this flipping church. Because, you know, churches have the steeple and then the long back to it. But when I made it, it was just nasty looking. But it's growing on me now. I need to put something right here, though, so it's not so bland. I wish you could make bigger clocks or something. I might have to get, like, a, a wall or a fence post and put a lantern on it. It would make it look cool. Okay. So now back over here to Fellowship Hall. We've got too many animals roaming around here. Too many. we got the giant rug finished. Okay, so my idea in here is that we're going to have... I like how I just nonchalantly smoked that sheep out of the door. That was dope. We're going to add a wall... Yeah, right next to the door. Like this. I'm going to have to get rid of this carpeting right here. We're going to make it just a little bit skinnier. And then probably add it like this, right? Oh, not like that. There we go. And yeah, and then there needs to be one under here, but I can't put a thing right there. So we're just going to throw it back here, out of sight, out of mind. And then what we're doing is we're going to make a top secret room. Now what I mean by that is it needs to be like a like a room for serious discussions, you know? Like we're we're gonna have some serious crap going on in here. Top secret. This is where the elite of the village is placed. Give me one second. Alright, so we're back. Uh sorry about that. I had a phone call and it distracted me from what was going on. I muted my microphone. I don't know why, because I could have just cut. But um, I recorded the rest of the video and I was muted the whole time, so I'll show you guys what I just did and then we'll, we'll put the carpet back in and then we're also going to put a chandelier in here. But what I did was put in a table like this and we got stairs as the chairs and then we also got the, the head of the table right here or that end. We fixed the windows so they're all even and yeah. And then we also got a bunch of bookshelves, and then through that end, I can't really remember what I recorded and didn't record, but we did that for now. We're going to get some more bookshelves and line up the top. But that looks good. I think that looks good. And we got plenty of blue wool for um, the carpeting, which before I turn any of these in the actual carpeting, i to get rid of this, and we'll put this back down. Uh, it says, Welcome to Fellowship Hall, right? I think it's what is it? I'm gonna have to put welcome um to fellowship hall and that's good. There we go. So welcome to fellowship hall. Now we're also gonna do what's under the doors. And this is how you get full carpeting in your house if you're doing like if you're wanting like an entire black carpeted floor or blue or red or whatever you just put normal blocks of wool underneath your door and then you got carpeting that's how you do that now let's turn the rest into carpeting probably not going to have enough to fill the entire floor right now but 
We've got some. Okay. Gosh dang it. Keeps going too fast. I hear you, spider. I hear you. You're not a threat. You're not a big deal. Okay. This is good. Ooh. I'm liking this. Just look at that. That's just so neat. You can't even tell that there's blue wool under the door. It just looks like it's natural carpeting. That just looks nicer. I hear you can tell, but it still looks better than just a piece of cobblestone. It just, yeah, it looks amazing. That's good. Okay, so now onto the chandelier, which I'm going to have to make. Or no, I have a crafting table. I'm going to leave that right there for now. And, okay, so I have, oh, I have pencils. Cool. I prepared. Okay, so we got to find the middle, which is right here. And then also the middle this way. So we're going to come down two. And then go out like this. And then that'll be the chandelier. That's really all there is to it. That's a little low. That's okay. That's okay. It looks alright. Should we do three like that? Yeah, that looks good. Okay, we got a super low chandelier, but it's... All right, because they're going to be sitting down. They're not going to be bumping their heads. If you're wanting to do like a dinner table type thing, which I guess that's what this room could be as well. Uh, kind of like a dining room for events. It's a birthday party room for the villagers. You got a nice little chandelier hanging from the ceiling. Can light up the place pretty well. Well, there we go. We got our top secret room slash birthday party room slash uh, dining room. Whatever, and then we got our little bookshelf. We need to finish the carpeting. You know, go back to my house and shear some sheep. Say that ten times fast. Shear some sheep. Shear some sheep. Oh my gosh. I almost didn't say that right. Okay, so that's about it for today's episode. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. Uh, also, go check out the new Last of Us videos. They are great. That game is phenomenal already, and I'm not even like an hour into it. Well, I'm probably an hour into it now, but I, I wasn't, and even then, it was still amazing. So go check those out, and I'll see you guys next time. Uh, peace out. Maybe you should take it slow.